Hi, um, good morning. My name is Jay, uh, one of the tech experts here in Techmatics. So today I'm going to introduce you and uh, show you how to um, create a custom field. Actually, um, there's uh, two options for you to um, create it. Uh, the first one should uh, be going to the um, custom field settings, which is um, here on the um, menu. Um, go to settings, which is the very bottom, and then um, scroll a bit down, and you would you would be able to see the uh, custom fields. And um, the second option should be uh, right in the forms, but I'm gonna show you that uh, later um, on this video. So um, in in terms with uh, how to create it here on the custom fields on settings, um, that would be on the custom fields here. And then um, all you have to do is uh, click um, add field um, for you to uh, add it, which is here on the right side of your screen, the top right side, uh, you'll be able to see add field. And then that's where you uh, would able to see the options that you could um, um, choose. So I'm going to introduce you, it to you one by one. Uh, but uh, they do have a preview as well, which is um, the great um, advantage of using Techmatics. Because you would able to see uh, the preview before you uh, proceed on how to... Um, on how to uh you know uh, create it for successfully so um first um this would be the preview which is the single line um that would still be um text um input and then a second option a multi line so um if you if it would be like a sentence or paragraph uh this a multi line would be the best option because single line would be like just a word or a phrase um, yeah, a, a single line would be for short, short, um, uh, forms and, uh, short, um, like phrases, uh, multi-line would be like a paragraph or explanation to something like that. And, um, text box list, it would be something like this, um, the preview box one, box two, for example, um, if it's courses like consultation, uh, first would be, um, you know, uh, have you taken any meds today? Um, like and then they would specify the medicines you know so something like that but you can choose whatever you want and then next is values so numbers on the value would um number specific only um it would be like um zip code i think zip code would be considered as a numbers only and then phone number if the phone number, I know that phone number already exists on the contacts option, but what if if it's like a, you know, uh, from a referral or a relative that they wanted to um add, um, uh, the phone number would be, uh, value phone number would be very helpful and monetary like donations and such or like um how much would you uh willing to pay. Um, monetary is uh, one of the best options for you if that's how um, it it you know works on your um, niche so um, next would be uh, choosing options so down single so um, the you would able to uh, preview it here as well so you can only choose one option okay and then drop down multiple it you, it will show you multiple of um it would select it would it will let your lead or customer select a multiple op option which is if you click one uh, option one um it will show here and then if you would able to click um option two as well it will show one and two okay so um redo select uh it's a simple if it's um you know um, like a survey or something if if uh, one out of five or something um, you can um, pick radio select uh, if it's someone like that and if it's checkbox um, it's self-explanatory um, if you have a lot of options they can um, you know checkbox whatever um, option would be the best and then um, date picker uh, this would be the best for like availability or um, you know preferred schedule it might be 
but i mean it, it it's it, it ups it you know it depends on um how your um business works as well so file upload um this is you know new um uh, in signature but uh, on file upload um now we, we have an option to like uh um add you know a, a photo it might be a pdf file um you know short uh like small a uh, file uh, we could able to um add it uh, also on our custom field and then signature um it, the uh we could um upload signature as well by you know choosing a file and then um if there's a pdf, PDF file or um J jpeg um they would able to upload it here on the signature as, as well but and that's how you um add it properly i'll just uh, for you to add it um s click whatever um you know custom field would be necessary and then click next um you know um i just add and uh, you know uh, name it properly and then um object object which is the file uh, folder should be so you can um, file it properly and then group contact and then placeholder uh, the placeholder is like this uh, this is the title and the placeholder is something like this field placeholder like this uh, pre-field value something like that and then once you have already filled the necessary necessary information that you um, need you can um, click save and it would automatically reflect here on the all fields and then um, I'm going to show you now the second option, which is going to the form itself. So by going to the forms, um, all you have to do is once you're here in the um, um, tech Techmatics menu, um, click Websites and Funnels. Once you're there, um, go to Forms, which is the top um, options, and then Builder. So um, on, on my case, I have already made a... Um, form so this is how you uh you were able to see so most of you uh most of you uh, already know how this form works but um i'm gonna show you anyway on how to add a custom field here on forms so um if ever you might not see this the option right here because i just closed it and uh, all you have to do is just click this plus for you to add form element Okay, click plus, uh, you're able to see custom field, click that, and then there's the thing um, that we needed to um, see, which is the add option. So click that, and then um, it would still be the same. Uh, text input values, uh, choosing options, and others. So, um, so in and so forth. So that's how you, uh, that's, those two options are the best a way for you to um, create a custom field so um that's all and um see you on the next video bye for now